Welcome back everyone. So yesterday I swapped the camera from the Mavic 2 Pro and I put it onto the Mavic 2 Zoom. So now we just need to go through and test and make sure everything's working. Now a lot of the requests that I had yesterday was that you wanted to see the Zoom camera now on the Pro. So I have now done that. So we now have the Mavic 2 Zoom with the Pro camera and the Mavic 2 Pro with the Zoom camera. Now, functionally, they should work um, you know, the same as they normally would with their normal camera on there, um, but we're gonna go through and make sure that all the flight modes and everything works. So um, although this used to be the Pro camera, it's now got the zoom on there, so we're gonna make sure we can zoom and do uh, all the stuff that you can normally do with the zoom. And on the model that used to have the Pro, Pro, that used to have the zoom camera now has the pro we're going to go through and make sure that the pro camera is operating and fully functioning even though it came on another drone now another thing that i had people ask was that if i actually swapped the cameras uh, i did so i'm going to show you the serial number on both drones and i'm going to show you the box that it came in so that way you can see that the box that said was the mavic 2 pro now has the zoom camera on it um, otherwise, I'm just gonna get out, uh, we'll go fly, I'll have the uh, iPad running the screen record again, and we'll just go through some of the basic functions to make sure that we still have full access to the perspective, you know, functions that we should have for each drone. So here you can see we've got the Mavic 2 Zoom box, and we'll go ahead and take a look at the serial number on there. Uh, so SJ2N is the last four, and here is the drone. And you can see on there, as soon as the camera focuses there, uh, you can see the matching last four, but this time you can see that we've got the pro camera on there. So it came as the zoom, but now it is the pro. Ooh. So now, of course, we've got the Mavic 2 Pro box. And again, you can see the serial number on there. So you can see the last four. And now I'll compare it to the last four on here as that focuses on there and you can see that it has the zoom camera so pro and but it's now the zoom okay so first off so we're flying around uh, we're in the normal mode here and let me open up the settings so there you go you can see the about and you can see on there that the uh, the flight controller serial number is the same last four as uh, the one on the box so you can see that this is indeed the zoom drone but it now has the pro camera now you can also see on there the version of the app that I'm running as well as the firmware. And I'll open up the uh, quick shot menu here so you can see hyperlapse, quick shot. Um, these are the normal ones that you're going to see with the Pro. And we'll open up our camera settings and we have aperture, we've got shutter, and we've got full manual. So you can see that um, you know we can play with that. So let's go ahead and first we'll uh, change the aperture here and Oh, drop the ISO and you can see on here that um, that's close to proper exposure but as we open up the aperture here we should get a brighter image yep there we go so you can see that the camera um, is showing up as the pro since we're able to adjust the aperture on there um, of course you can do just shutter or just aperture if you're trying to keep a, a certain um, setting go to auto here now let's open up the settings um, can see everything on there. Uh, camera settings, there we go. So 4K24, so you can see the uh, normal modes here that we'd have with the Pro version. Video format, color, uh, video coding. So once again, this is the Mavic 2 Zoom, but I've taken that camera off and we put the Pro camera in its place. But otherwise, I mean, you can see everything is functioning and there's no errors or anything with the drone itself. Uh, but otherwise, I mean, you can see that the camera's working. We can pan up and down. Um, normally with the zoom, um, we'd be able to zoom in and out, but we don't have that here on the sidebar uh, because we have the pro camera. So that should do it here with the uh, pro camera on the zoom drone. However, let's swap over and check out the original Mavic 2 Pro that now has the zoom camera on there and see if we have the zoom functions. All right, so now we've got the Mavic 2 Pro in the air, but we've got the zoom camera on there. 
and you can see right off the bat that we do have the zoom function on there so it does appear to be working and again the drone booted up with no issues the only thing that i noticed is that when it did first turn on and i noticed this yesterday is on the map it showed that i was in in china at the dji headquarters um, but then of course it updated and came back here so i would assume that that's maybe it resetting because the camera's in there um, but you can see right off the bat that we do have the function or the zoom function on there. So let's go ahead and take a look at the serial numbers and the information on the drone. And right here, you can see that the flight controller number pulls up and that is the one that originally came as the Mavic 2 Pro. Um, but of course, now we've got the zoom camera on there, so we have those options. So now that we are up here, let's test out. And as you can see, we can zoom in and out. So that is nice. Um, but let's try out some of the modes just to see uh, to see here if it is indeed working. And you can see the normal functions and everything that we have here. However, let's do quick shot. Um, but now you can see we've got dolly zoom on there because we have the zoom camera. So with that, uh, it does the normal dolly zoom shot. But let's still give that a try and uh, see if that will work. Three, two, one. All right, so it does look like it went through and it did that dolly zoom shot. Um, you can see it functioning right there. Um, so I'd say this is pretty pretty good. Um, so now we have evidence that the drone does work with both the Pro and the zoom camera without sending it into DJI to have uh, updated or swapped out. Now, if you have any other questions, make sure you put those down in the comments below and subscribe to the channel, of course, if you haven't done so yet. And I'll see you in the next video.